Hi, my name is Sky, and I have another message for Jack Thompson. Mr. Thompson, I understand what you're trying to do. I agree with your motivation. You want to help society. You want to help American society. You feel that there is a blemish, a cancer, and it needs to be taken care of. And I understand where you're, you're feeling. Because you're looking around and it's like, what's, what's wrong with our society? Why are these bad things happening? And I agree with you. I just think that video games are not the cause. They're not the source of the problem. Game Informer Magazine, uh, issue 143, March 2005. Interview with, you know, Dungeons and Dragons creator Dave Arneson. And he talked about how, at one point, there was uh, worries that D&D, &D, you know, led to some problems. You know, that uh, it caused some kids to run away, to have, you know, social problems, stuff like that. And he, even he, he said that these kids were playing a game, they got lost, one kid got lost in some tunnels, they found the kid later on, but the initial accusation that Dungeons and Dragons were responsible was, you know, not retracted. Um, and they said that it happens all the time. You know, and it's the same thing with like anything else. With you know, music, with you know, t television shows, with culture. You know, whatever there is, it's going to kind of have a little friction with the dominant culture and that's where people are going to assume that's where the problem is. But the thing is, you know, people are not uniform. Not everybody's the same. And the American society recognizes that and deals with that. And as a result, that's why we can have so many different people who can live and interact with each other. And occasionally you are going to get people who are a little nuts in the head. And it's just the nature of the, you know, nature of the human being is that we have some people who are totally sane, totally sociable and some people who are not. And it's just the way it is, you know. And it's just you know, it's a you know who knows a survival mechanism, because sometimes you need more social people, sometimes you need more antisocial people, and whatever the case, that's the kind of people who are going to you know survive in you know whatever environment they're in. I don't feel that video games are responsible for violence in schools. Both my parents are school teachers. They can tell you stories all the live long day about violence. And they can tell you over and over again that the root cause are the parents. It's the lifestyle. It's where the kids come from. That's what causes problems. This kid down in New Mexico who was abused by his father and, you know, in so many ways and then ended up shooting his family because of that, it's not a result of video games. It's a result of his family. It's a result of his family, you know, lifestyle of being abused physically and sexually of just, you know, being tormented by his, you know, little sister even. You know, you don't blame video games for that. It's just not the way, you know, it doesn't work like that, sir. I understand, and I think that you are doing a good job, but you're just, you're, you know, the direction, your goal, you know, the, or the, the, your target is wrong. You need to change it, sir. Please. I know you can do good. I know you, you're trying to do good. I think you're just attacking the wrong thing. You're attacking a culture. Cultures are not bad influences. It's like with rap music. Rap music, you know, people said, oh, it's, it's so bad and horrible. It's a cultural phenomenon. It unites a group of people. It makes them feel good. It's what they like to listen to. Does it inspire activities? You know what? Activities are inspired by needs and demands and desires. You know, if kids feel that they're invincible, they'll jump off of cliffs. If, uh, you know, people feel that they need money, they'll rob other people. It's just the way it is. You know, the culture, the music, the, you know, c clothes that identify you, it doesn't, you know, mean who you are as a person, what you're capable of doing. You know, Mr. Thompson, you're an intelligent man. You're a capable man. You're a compassionate man. Please, do the right thing. Don't attack video games. They're not the cause of problems. Other things are the cause. And if anything, you know, why aren't you attacking the government? Why aren't you, you know, you know, questioning the government, change certain behaviors and things, and why aren't you attacking things like, you know, up in Massachusetts with the big dig and the tunnel that's collapsing? Why don't you go look for the safety of those people? Thank you.